Hi, I'm Jonathan. I'm an engineer at Open Kernel Labs. Today, I'm going to be talking about the performance of OKL 2.1 on the IA32 architecture. We've pitted OKL 4 against KVM. Now, we've taken two common platforms, the desktop E6400 and the upcoming mid-platform, the Intel Atom. Now, OKL 4 2.1 has made huge improvements in IA32 performance. We've taken advantage of SysEnter, SuperPages, DMA, we've done lots of stuff. Now, both of these architectures have VT extensions, so of course we've compiled KVM with them just to give it a fair match. Now, we've done some tests. First up, we did a traditional Linux kernel compile. Now, we've presented here percentages overhead of the compilation time on native Linux. We did on OK Linux, we get ourselves an overhead of 8%. Not bad, right? Now, we took a KVM and did the same thing. Guess what we found? 28%. Now, if that's not enough evidence, let's have a look at LM Bench. Here we've done fork and exec. We found KVM has an overhead of four to five times slower than OK Linux. Our conclusion, OKL4 kicks ass.